Alfred Hitchcock famously called film little pieces of time. I'm but back in class. As he what the hell? Eyes. These pieces of time can frame us in our glory and our I have to listen to this Jefferson lecture again. This color, might be hell. Now, can you give me an example of a photographer okay, who perfectly this captured is messed the condition up. in black and white? Am I stuck in a time loop? Anybody? Bueller? Diane Arbus. Be calm and go, don't Gloria. freak out. Why Arbus? Yet. Because of her images of hopeless faces, you feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and children. She saw humanity as tortured. Right? What's going on? And frankly, it's bullshit. Nobody even cares? Keep that to yourself. Seriously, though, I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. Everybody's gone now. Have I totally fucked up time? This doesn't make sense. Not yet, you bastard. You didn't die, Kate. You're alive. Too creepy. That's me? Are you kidding? Rachel didn't deserve any of this. Oh no. I'm not going to take the bait. I'm not. I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. I just wanted to know if you'd like to spend the rest of your life in my dark room. Your purity inspires me so much, and we could be so happy together. Who needs selfies when I can give you portraiture? There's no way I'm saying that. No way. It's about time somebody finally killed Chloe. Think of how often that bitch almost got me killed. It's like you're doing both of us an awesome favor. Chloe can never appreciate you the way I will, Maxine. And yes, I insist on calling you Maxine forever. This can't be real. I don't believe it. I see you, Max Co- Oh, if you'd like to spend the rest of your life in my dark room. Your purity inspires me so much, and we could be so happy together. Who needs selfies when I can give you portraiture? I cannot say this. My selfies are shit. I need to be framed by a real artist. I'm just a poser. Yes, you will be posing. For me. There's so many angles I want to expose you with to the world. I hope you don't mind needles or duct tape. I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. I just wanted to know if you'd like to spend the rest of your life in my dark room. Your purity 
inspires me so much, and we could be so happy together. Who needs selfies when I can give you portraiture? Oh, please, I, I do not want to say that. I like to think of it as our dark realm. It's the only place I truly feel safe and protected from the storm. Of course, Max. I can capture you over and over. You can be my model for life and death. We are going to be so happy together in the dark. Just make sure you stay pure. I won't like it if you get dirty like Rachel or Chloe. I see you, Max. Oh, if you'd like to spend the rest of your life in my dark room. Your purity inspires me so much, and we could be so happy together. Who needs selfies when I can give you portraiture? Why is this happening? I've been dreaming of the day when you would finally tell me. I love you, Mr. Jefferson. Call me Mark. We need to play catch up on all the time we've wasted, especially since there's nobody left in your life. I love you too, Max. Max, why did you stop me from jumping? What kind of friend are you? You never understood me, or what happened to me. Now my family will never leave me alone, and that means I'll always be alone. Thanks to you. Kate, that's not true. I've always been your friend. Never ends. I, I better find something. Oh, Zero! 
Rachel took my place. I'm glad she was there for you. Six months ago, she just left Arcadia. Without a word. Without me. How do you know she disappeared? Maybe she wanted to start a totally new life. Unlike you, she would have told me, okay? Something happened to her. Before Rachel left, she said she met somebody who changed her life. Then poof. Rachel, Rachel, why the fuck are you wearing a bracelet? Calm yourself, right? It was a gift. Do you think that Rachel and I would have been friends? You're not that different. She had, has a great eye for images and for art. Plus, she's a smart ass like you. We would all be hella best friends forever. I miss Rachel too. But think about yourself, Max. Principal Wells told me about what you said happened in the back. Sounds like you totally crushed on Rachel. You would have too. Smart, sexy, sassy. I know this has been an awful day, and you can talk to me anytime, Mr. Jefferson. I wish we had your pets no scams again. We're the club. I'm not sure if 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 I'm not
Almost it. Don't try to hide, Max! Get over here! Let me capture you! Jefferson is coming after me again. Max! No you more. used to be so pure, so innocent. Now, you have to die. Please understand, Max. The only place I can be my selfie is in the dark room. I can't believe you let that hillbilly murder me in cold blood. Maybe I'll be safe in the lighthouse. What? Happened Maybe I'll wake to up. Your spark, Max. I thought I could be your professor for life. I realize now you'll never be an artist, much less a photographer. Come here, Max. Class is dismissed. Max! Class is dismissed. I miss those days when you looked at me in class with those wide eyes. I want to be your professor again. I can teach you so Max, remember what John Lennon said. Blackwell, Happy. This is Principal is Wells, and I'm here to drop them. Good evening, Blackwell. This is Miss Max. You can also manipulate time. Okay, so my rewind power does work here. I can use it if I'm careful. Good evening, Blackwell. To play. Stop! Rav. I said get in the car now! We'll cruise with Max! Rav. Hey! Rav. I said get in the car now! We'll cruise to the drive-in, and you'll be close to me forever, and we'll go ape, ape, ape. She's a bad influence. Did that get you hot when you saw me fuck up Nathan? I did. Tell Max's parents that she's a nosy little bitch. Hey! 
governments to make sure I'll you never sick David Madsen on their ass. Come over here. I said get in the car now! If only Kate Marsh would have jumped off that roof. Too bad you didn't become friends with the Tabanga. She's a bad influence. Oh. Who wants to make Come over here. Sick David Madsen on their ass. I said, here. get in the car now! If only Sports Kate Marsh would have jumped off that roof. Admit it! Could blame Miss Caulfield and finally Too get her bad. kicked you out of Blackwell. Friends with the She's a bad influence. The work while you you can't escape my fine. surveillance, Missy! Chloe is a loser just like you, Max. And hey! You Over here. I'm gonna cut you open, freak. Those were my beans, Max. Those were my fuck. Max, maybe you'd be a lot happier. You will be my greatest portrait, Max. Get your bony ass. Come on, girly. Max, you'd be a lot happier. You will be my greatest portrait, Max. Get your bony ass over here. I'm gonna cut you open, freak. If only you could have seen Rachel. My blood. Those were my beans, Max. Those were my fucking beans. Max, Rachel not only gave great headshots. I sure she gave you great think we're buddies now. Especially after I dug her body up to be with her one final time. <laughs> why are you looking at me like that? Oh, oh, oh Rachel, this man. You should have heard Chloe <laughs> smack talk. Max, sit down. You're taking a time out no matter what. If this is my nightmare, let me have one sanctuary. Of course, this is where Chloe and Rachel used to hide from the world. But I can't hide for long. Whatever reality I'm in feels like a bad dream. Am I just not learning my lesson? Maybe your real lesson is to get out of this place. Just don't be afraid, Max. Let them be afraid of you. Psst. Max. Me and Rachel are floating down here in the sewer. Come on down. Don't you dare question the chef. Right, like you're the real cook here? I am, when your mom's away. I'll let her know that. Hello? Hey, honey. Just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're all going to work at the two wins. What? Didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course I'll come pick you up. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Love you.
Excuse me, ladies, I have to go rescue yonder queen at the Save Mart. She doth have many bags of delicious grub for us you to feast You are ridiculous. Tomorrow. You'll be grateful for that someday. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund? Keys, please. Where are those keys? Another dollar for the swear jar! You're bankrupting me! Aha! You can't hide from me forever! Now lock up after I leave. Play nice. Try not to destroy too much of the house. And no Chloe and Max wine tasting session. will this nightmare go on? I think you'd be perfect for my new photo series on retro grunge. You have the same qualities that I loved in Rachel Amber, but not Max. Max is a fucking child. Oh Christ, I know. And she never shuts up, does she? I'm so over her hipster bullshit. I think everyone at Blackwell is over Max. Let's prove it. Booyah, Warren. I thought you were all over Max's shit. She's not all that. So who cares if she doesn't kiss me? Oh, you should have seen her make a move on me in my room. Hello, lame. Max should see me make a move on you. Come here. God damn, you are a sexy bitch. Why hang out with Max, huh? Boredom. Plus, she's like my personal puppet. I hear that. Do you want a party? I got a drugstore in my room. <laughs> oh shit, look at Max spying on us. Take a fucking picture, bitch. Or take a selfie. See, this is how you bust a move, Max. No mosh pit for you, shaka bra. Damn, Victoria. You're a real woman. Not a little girl like Max. I fucking love your tats, Chloe. You're so hot. I can't believe it took us so long to hook up. Why did you get rewind powers? You don't even know how to use them. Rachel's dead and you're still alive. Life is so not fair. I wish she would have never come back to Arcadia Bay. You're the real storm. I'll be so grateful if this is the last digicode. Great, numbers are all over the place. How will I find the right code?
I'll be so grateful if this is the last digicode. Now, why doesn't the mirror reflect any of the numbers? Don't kill us, Max! I guess I'll never dance again, Max. Right when I was about to start a new life in California. Shit, I was happy Max. just being your friend. Yeah, I thought we were on the same team. Why do you want all your friends to no, die? I'll die alone. Max, please save us. Honey, I always thought of you like a daughter. And now you're gonna take me away from my family. So this is how Max gets her revenge that? on. Breaker, breaker. Thanks for saving me and I know carrying I the load, been the best buddy. principal to That's you. That's a big 10 for. But you've been a great everyday hero for us. Please save us. Guess my husband and new don't baby. Let the squirrels die. We'll have to go I without wish you. we had been friends, Max. Please, Max, don't you kill me. You always my back. We can finally have our one to let you die. Thanks. I'm still Max. a teenager. Don't let the squirrels die. <sighs> Who are you? Holy shit, are you cereal? I'm you, dumbass. Or I'm one of many Maxes you've left behind. Can you get me out of here? Oh, so you want help? <laughs> Thought you could control everybody and everything, huh? Twist time around your fingers? I tried to help. I only wanted to do the right thing. No, you only wanted to be popular. And once you got these amazing powers, your big plan was to trick people into thinking you give a rat's ass. I do care. That's why I was trying to make friends. By telling people what they want to hear? <laughs> you were just looking for a shortcut because you can't make friends on your own. That's not true. I have great friends and I've used my powers for good. Please stop playing innocent. You're a goddamn hypocrite. You've left a trail of death and suffering behind you. That was not my fault, you son of a bitch. Don't you dare talk about our mom that way. <laughs> what about the crap that was your fault? Wait, wait, let me guess. You fucked up time and space for your precious punk Chloe? <laughs> you think she's worth all that? We all are. This isn't about Chloe, or even me anymore. Gosh, you're so selfless now, Mahatma Max. 
It's too bad you pissed your power away on high school drama. Chloe does a better job of guilt tripping me than you do. Because you let her bully you. It's called Stockholm Syndrome. But you didn't do that homework, so you have to learn the hard way. Like Rachel. Just shut up. You're not scaring me anymore. I'd be more worried about Chloe killing us than Jefferson. Max, do you really think she has any feelings for us? You're just another puppet. Man, you are so stupid. <laughs> I'm embarrassed to have the same name. And someday Chloe will destroy... Oh hell, speak of the devil. Dude, do not even fuck with her head. She knows what we went through together this week, and you don't. There's no way you can break up our team. This is reality. After five years, you're still Max Caulfield. I am seriously glad to see you. Welcome home, Max. Fasten your seatbelt. I, uh, know it was your birthday last month. This was my real father's camera. I want you to have it. Yes, of course it's cool. Thank you. This camera is so sweet. Now that we got that mushy shit out of the way, I feel like stage diving. Let's thrash this place. Yep, yep, I'm fucking insane in the brain. Let's dance. Shake that bony white ass. Or take my picture with your new camera. This song fucking rules. Can't dance, hippie? Come on. Rock out, girl. Yo, turn it off. Turn it off. You need to hide now. My stepdad will kill me if he finds you here. You were here today, Max. You saved me. I'm still tripping on that. Seeing you after all these years feels like... Destiny. If this is destiny, I hope we can find Rachel. I miss her, Max. What the hell is this? Snowflakes? Or a storm is coming? Max, start from the beginning. Tell me everything. Let's talk about your superpower. Epic! I pledge allegiance to Max and the power for which she stands. You can rewind time, Max. That's fucking insane. We have to play. You need a sidekick to guide you. Okay, girl wonder. Show me the way to Chloe's cave. Welcome to American Rust, my home away from hell. Raw and rough. It suits you. Max, do you know how awesome this is? I get my best friend back, and she's also super-sized? I don't feel so super. Uh, Max, here, um, let me help you find a place to chill. You freaked me out there. Do you feel any better now? You saved me again! Crazy! Now we're totally bonded for life. Since you're the mysterious superhero, I'll be your faithful chauffeur and companion. My powers might not last, Chloe. That's okay. We will. Forever. 